now the West Rebels are looking to do something no other 5A team has done. That's win back-to-back-to-back -back -back state championships. LeBar Brown's squad is an impressive 29-1 over the past two seasons. But this year, there's no C.J. Smith on defense or Marshawn Bowers on offense. Coach Brown says although they have big poles to replace, the younger guys are stepping up and most importantly, embracing the Rebels' culture. A culture focused on building good character men, not just hardware in a trophy case. We talked early on in the spring that that our program's not defined by state championships. Our, our program is def defined by the way uh, we treat each other, the way we love each other, and, and we want that to continue. I, we didn't want that to get lost in the in the state championships. I think a, the state championships are a byproduct of, of our culture at our school. We just gotta put our heads down and work. Just listen to the blueprint. Do what Coach Brown tells us to do. And that's it. I wouldn't want to be anywhere the expe expectations were not high, but they're always going to be high at West High School, and, and we're looking forward to the challenge. West kicks off the season two weeks from tonight against Bearden. The Rebels beat the Bulldogs in last season's opener 14-10. to 10. That'll do it for sports. We'll be right back.